Hey guys, it's Thomas. So welcome to Thingiverse Thursday, the 8th episode. Because we're already on the 8th episode of our Thingiverse Thursday uploads. So because Christmas is in four whole days, I decided to print something Christmas themed. Let's get started. So the models I have for you today are these um, 3D Christmas trees <laughs> by a user on Thingiverse by the name of Bugman140. He's an amazing designer, and these Christmas trees, just so you know, are not dual extrusion prints. Just so you know, I didn't get a plus or anything. So, it seems like all these new models I find, I'm the last one to catch up to the hype of these models. It seems to always go Xander, James, then me. Also, James over at Print and Play, I forgot to have him out in the last video, just as an amazing guy in our community. He's an amazing guy. If um, I'll put his channel link in the description below. He's amazing. He's an amazing guy. So, Bugman140, he's made the two-piece design, which has two colors, but there's even three or four piece. So, I'll put the links to all of those in the description below. He's an amazing designer. So, the models twist together. They put like this. I can even get them apart. So they just put them like this. There's two separate files. They're slightly different. And they just twist together. So they just twist together like so. Then you got a nice Christmas tree. I actually prefer these to my two failed Christmas trees. These actually, I think, look nicer. So put them together and just do this. So I printed these in my standard generic PLA that I got off eBay for $15 a kilogram. It's actually a pretty good PLA. And I printed this at 0.2 millimeter layer height at 60 millimeters be uh, bed temperature and a 210 degree hot end. So I, for bed adhesion I used a combination of tape and glue. And I also did zero shells, no, I did two perimeters with zero percent infill. I also printed these at 75 percent scale. So they'd be slightly smaller and take like an hour less time to print. So it's not, there's not much more to say about these. I just twist them together, I guess. But I like how, um, if you look down to them from the center, you can see there's a spiral going around. As um, These are the candy cane Christmas trees, which are quite cool to print. These do have kind of large overhang, so they're not the, if you got bad part cooling, I wouldn't suggest you print these, unless you have decent enough part cooling. Otherwise, I'd highly recommend you print these. But then I just realized I'm just gonna keep them here for till Christmas ends, then I'm gonna not touch them for another year. Maybe I'll leave them out on my desk because they look nice. <laughs> so, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you're not already subscribed, you can subscribe to my channel here, and be sure to click that notification bell so you can get notified of any new content. Don't forget to smash that like button, or uh, like that smash button. So, bye!